Hey everyone, it's Alexa with the Ask Alexa Show and it's episode 10. So that is two times. I'm running out of fingers and I promise I won't start using any toes, but I thought that I would do today's show based off of the 10 commandments of home buying, seeing as it's episode 10. So I want you to get a piece of paper and a pen and start writing these down. So number one is thou shalt not change jobs or become self-employed when looking for a home. That is something you definitely don't wanna do. Number two, thou shalt not buy a truck, car, van, boat, anything with wheels, don't buy it unless it's a hot wheel car. That is all you're allowed to buy. It will affect your qualification. Number three, thou shalt not use credit cards for large purchases. That could affect your qualification as well. Mess with your debt to income ratios and you don't want to do that. Number four, thou shalt not spend the money you've saved for closing. If you have a great loan officer, they should be able to kind of give you a ballpark and a good estimate of what your closing costs are going to be and educate you on where those numbers might fluctuate and the fees that are out of their control and then certain situations that might arise um, that could change those numbers. Number five, thou shalt not co-sign for another loan. So if you're already on one, that's okay. As long as you've disclosed it with your loan officer, it should show up on the credit report and that should already be factored in, but do not sign up for any new ones. Don't co-sign on a credit card. Do not co-sign for a car for your children. Just don't do it. Number six, thou shalt not change bank accounts. Number seven, thou shalt not originate any more inquiries on your credit card. So don't go apply for a new credit card. Don't let anyone else pull your credit because that is what is, the credit that your loan officer has is what you're qualified on. And if your ratios are tight and your credit is tight, you don't wanna mess with that. So number eight, thou shalt not purchase any furniture or appliances. Those sales are always going to be around. Black Friday's around the corner. We have sales constantly. You will find something good. So number nine, thou shalt not omit from telling your loan officer any debts or liabilities that you have on the application. And number 10, thou shalt not make any large deposits without checking with your loan officer first. So if you do these things, I promise you that you will be led in the right direction. And as far as committing any of those, that could definitely alter your qualification and you can lose the home of your dreams. You do not want to do that. So keep that in mind. If you want any more information on those or you want me to send you a cool little handout that I have that has those all written down so you don't forget, write me a comment below and let me know or text me, give me a call and I will gladly send that your way. I want everyone to check this out though. If I can, oh, I can't reverse my camera. Look at that. Holy cow, folks, we live in a beautiful place. I hope you have a great night, and I will talk to you guys later.